we worship you. Hallelujah. Hela baba ba. Rebe boko yanda. We worship you, mighty God. We worship you, mighty Savior. We worship you, Jesus. In the beauty of your presence. At this hour, Lord, we glorify your name. Precious people of God, wherever you are connecting, wherever you are watching this broadcast, I want to bring the word of God to you. And my today's topic is opening closed doors and breaking walls by force in the name of Jesus Christ. Viewers, over the course of fighting for your destiny, remember I said in one of my broadcasts that life is a battlefield. You need to fight for your destiny. And I said, the more you fight for your destiny in prayer, in involving God, the more victories you are likely to experience. And I'm here to stand in the gap, to pray together with you, to call upon the name of God. As you fight for your destiny, we are joining you in prayer in the name of Jesus Christ. The Bible says in the book of Joshua, chapter number 6, verse number 1, now Jericho was strictly shut up because of the children of Israel. None went out, none, none came in. And the Lord said to Joshua, See, I have given unto thy heart Jericho and the king thereof and the mighty men of Vela. Joshua chapter number 6 verse number 1. Jericho was a loud city and it had gates it had strong walls and the children of Israel on their way to the promised land they met a, stram a stumbling block and this was the city of Jericho and the inhabitants and the kings of Jericho they refused they say you cannot pass through this land Yes, I know you are claiming you are going to the promised land. I know you are claiming you are going to where God has said you go, but you are not going to pass. I'm speaking to somebody today in the name of Jesus. Yes, they know you need to be doing that business. They know you need to be in that employment. They know you need to be in that marriage. But they have put a stumbling block between you and your miracle. I'm here to prophesy. I'm here to pray with you. Wherever you're watching this broadcast, I'm here to declare the word of God that any stumbling wall, any city, any mountain, any block that have been standing before you preventing you from accessing your divine destiny let it be broken let it be destroyed let it come out in the name of Jesus Christ watch this the Bible says God intervened and he told Joshua see you are my people I cannot let you down at the time of need and that is the beauty watch this that is the beauty of our God God is able to intervene in our crisis. And in every crisis, note that God, when He is involved, He gives a miracle. If you are passing through any kind of crisis, know that you are a prime candidate for a miracle. If you read the Bible, over the 40 miracles that Jesus did here on planet earth he was trying to correct a crisis he was trying to solve a situation viewer your crisis is about to give birth to a miracle 
God said, yes, they have said that you cannot pass, but by the authority, by the power that I have, I have given you the city of Jericho, its fighting men, and also the kings, oh, the principalities, the powers, the demons that have been attacking your destiny, already they have been given to you as a spoil. You are already above them. In the name of Jesus. Watch this. The Bible says in Joshua chapter number 6, verse number 16. And it came to pass that at the, as the seventh time when the priest blew with the trumpet, Joshua said unto the people, Shout, for the Lord has given you the city. So the people shouted when the priest blew the trumpet. And it came to pass when the people heard the sound of the trumpet. The people shouted with a great shout. The wall fell down flat, so that the people went up into the city. Every man straight before him, and they took the city. This is how the battle of the city of Jericho was won. God was involved. And when God said in verse number one, that I have given you the city of Jericho, its fighting men and the kings, the Bible said, tell the people to go loud about the city of Jericho seven times in a day for seven days and in the seventh day when they go loud about the city let them shout unto the lord let them celebrate unto the lord somebody celebrate because the war that have been preventing you from prosperity it is breaking tonight in the name of jesus the chains that have been binding your prosperity they are breaking tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. That curse is breaking. That force of darkness is breaking. That generational pattern of failure, it is breaking in the name of Jesus. They went loud about the city seven times and they made a big shout unto the Lord. Oh, we serve a victorious God. We serve a God that fights for his people. God is about to fight for you. The war belongs to God. He shall give you victory. Don't worry my brother. Don't worry my sister. Just let God be involved. And that war. That door that has been shut. It is going to break in the name of Jesus. People of God. There are doors that we are opening by force. By the mystery of the power of God in this spiritual context in this atmosphere we are opening the doors of finances in the name of jesus we are opening the doors of marriages marriage doors that have been closed we are opening them right now in the name of jesus wherever you're watching this door and you are not married or your marriage broke away god is about to do something for you God is about to fight for you and to give you victory in the name of Jesus. There are doors that are opening at this hour, at this season. Doors to get visa. Doors to travel to your destination of blessing in the name of Jesus Christ. There are doors of jobs. There are doors of businesses. There are doors of doing ministry that are opening. Resources are opening up. That doors those doors are opening doors of fruitfulness they are opening right now in the name of jesus people of god there are wars that we are destroying right now in this moment of prayer the wars of witchcraft that have been surrounding your destiny they are breaking right now in the name of jesus the walls of rejection, they are breaking right now in the name of Jesus. The walls of poverty, they are breaking right now in the name of Jesus. The walls of limitation, they are breaking right now in the name of Jesus. And marriage, forces and demons, that war is breaking right now in the name of Jesus. 
every war against progress it is breaking right now in the name of Jesus as the word of God says in the book of Joshua chapter number 6 already Jericho has been given to us Jericho is any situation that stands before you that is hindering you from accessing your divine destiny your divine miracle and the Lord has spoken and the word of God is truth it is power it has already been given to you in the name of Jesus Christ may the Lord bless you as I have prayed for you maybe you are watching this broadcast and you need the power of God to save you away from sin repeat this prayer after me say Lord Jesus save me today forgive me my sins write my name in the book of life you have been forgiven start living a kingdom driven life commit sin no more in the name of Jesus I have prayed for you that bondage has been broken and every closed doors for your blessing it has been opened and every wall that have been standing before you on your destiny journey it has been broken in Jesus name God bless you May the Lord do you good in the name of Jesus.